Too real to be my imagination.
Okay, let's see what happens. He's already dead. I gotta get out of this lab.
Voices. showed me the way. I am his now. I helped him hide. And in exchange, he gave me a new life. A life as a slave. You'll never understand. For that, you'll burn! Get out of here. Get out of here. Gotta put the flames he out. He commands that I take care of you. You can either die or change like me. Sebastian, listen to him. You change your minds like where are you? Stop fighting. I'm a weak force. I won't come down easy. You're gonna pay for this. Zoom. 
Give in. All the confusion and guilt will go away. I'm sorry, Master. I won't let him get away. I promise. Stop him. I can't stop him if I can't find him, O'Neill. 
He face shifted. He's not here. Not anywhere. The machine in the room next door. You've got to destroy it. What machine? He made me build it. To hide him. Destroy it. So that you can destroy him. What happened? How did O'Neill get turned into that thing? I don't know. I've been locked in my safe house since you left. When Liam called and asked me to meet him, I was so relieved to hear his voice. But he wasn't Liam. He was that thing. I tried to get through to him, but... You heard him. Theodore Wallace did something to him. Poor guy. I didn't want to have to kill him. You didn't have a choice. Theodore wasn't going to give him up. So what now? Let's take a look at this machine O'Neill was talking about. I think it's on the other side of the room where you found us. Let's go. Flamethrower. I could use this, but it's broken. If I found the right parts... of influence. Theodore's sticking his fingers in every part of this place. It's almost like a form of communication with him. I would never disobey. Of course I would. Yes, Master. Of course. The machine is operating as it should. <sighs> Thank you. Father Theodore, to hear you say that, it fills me with pride. What? But she is harmless to us. She's not... No. I would never disobey. Of course I will. Whatever pleases you. You can go. Can you hear me? I'm in the fabrication room. Clearances don't mean much when everyone's dead. Just... Please come and meet me here. I have something to show you. It's important. I'm sorry, Yukiko. But he demands it. So you know Theodore Wallace? Of course. He's head of recruitment. But what's he doing in STEM? And why is he doing this? There's a lot going on that you don't know about. Theodore wants Lily for himself. You saw what he did to O'Neill. He'll do that to everybody in here if he has to. 
He'll tear this place apart to get his hands on her. I can't let that happen. What is it? I'm not totally sure, but it looks a hell of a lot like the stable field emitter. Whatever it is, O'Neill said to destroy it. So that's what I'm gonna do. And I know just how. It's me. Sebastian. I'm starting to think you forgot about me. Have you finished arming that cookie dough of yours? I have. Looking for an excuse to use it too. Good. I'm sending you my coordinates. Bring the big guns. We're going hunting. Got it. I'm already gone. See you soon. I'm almost ready over here. Let me know when you're good to go. Tell me something, Torres. So you knew Hoffman before this? Everybody knows Hoffman. You don't get into Mobius without passing through her office. Can she be trusted? I might have said no before, but nothing like being abandoned by your corporate masters to make you rethink your position. She's trapped in here like the rest of us. Hmm. So you're not sure? Yeah, she's not bad. Just a bit of a cold fish. I have trouble completely trusting people who look at me like I'm something in a petri dish. I don't know what's gonna happen when we blow this thing up. Me either, but at least we're being proactive. I don't think we're gonna convince Theodore to leave Lily alone. He doesn't seem like the kind of guy who can be talked into doing the right thing. So you're giving me orders to shoot on sight? I'm just saying be prepared for anything. You can't predict what's gonna happen in this place. No offense, but how did someone as smart and headstrong as you wind up in an organization like Mobius? I was a demolitions expert in the army. They loaned me out to Mobius for some black ops stuff. Once my term was up, they came knocking. And you just joined up like that? They were pretty good salesmen. They don't tell you everything when you sign up. I was... tasked with some things that I'm not proud of. They expect you to follow blindly, and... If you disobey, when Myra offered me the opportunity to get out, I had to take it. I've still got some morals left, despite the things that I've had to do. Is that enough to take care of this thing? Like ten times over. And it's ready to go when you are. I'm good to go. I'm going to check out the equipment in the other room. Good luck, you two. Okay, here we go. Operation Kick Ass happening in three, two, one. <coughs> Are you okay, Torres? Torres? Where'd you? Sebastian Castellanos, you refuse to step into the darkness, so you try to bring me to the light. Your rash decisions have always been your downfall. Come then, I will. 